गाइस वेलकम टू फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइस टुडे आई क्रिएट रियली बेसिक एंड फॉर बिगिनर्स एनिमेशन ट्यूटोरियल इन सिनेमा 4D R19 सो फर्स्टली गाइस आई टेक दिस शेप फोर साइड शेप दिस वन एंड चेंज साइज गाइस गो टू हियर ऑब्जेक्ट एंड ए साइज चेंज एंड बी साइज चेंज आई टेक हाफ सो दैट्स 200 एंड टेक हाफ लाइक 100 एंड बी आई टेक 50 सेंटीमीटर यस and change plane plane size change like x z yes and take extrude tool this one so guys select this four side and mix child with extrude yes and i go to display select all shading lines yeah but guys that's not correct so select this extrude and movement i take zero go to mid one i take like two yes right okay so guys i go to caps and start caps take fill it and cap take fill it and guys radius i take two centimeter and two yes and step i take five yeah see guys that's my simple shape right okay so guys now i take cloner so i go to mograph and use cloner and guys select this extrude and mix child with cloner yeah guys select this cloner and mode i use guys this time honeycomb array this one yes go to back and guys now i change orientation so that's gone here orientation and take last one yes and decrease this spacing so guys mode i take per step and that's my size decrease like this and closer Guys, I take like breadth size, I take like 55 and height decrease, take like 55, yes. See guys, now that's correct. See guys, size breadth, I take 55 centimeter and size height, I take 55. And guys, I increase count breadth like 50 and 50 yes that's good okay guys change this height so decrease that's like increase like 50 height and breadth size decrease i take like 40 yeah okay guys i take like 35 yeah 35 is better see guys that's my setting right okay so guys now i apply this time plane effector tool so select this cloner and i go to mode and i go to more graph effector and use plane yes and guys go to parameter and position y axis decrease i take like 50 centimeter and rotation check and guys r dot p rotation i take like 360 yeah and i go to fall off guys shape use torus right see guys that's my simple shape as if you have cinema 4d r20 so i show you that's my cinema 4d r20 open yes guys that's my cinema 4d r20 so i show you so i take plane and go to plane and i go to fall off and see guys that's my line of field and you can take this time torus this one guys that's same same fall off shape torus and that's my torus field right okay so guys again i go to cinema 4d r19 and now guys i create animation so fall off this one i take 100 percent and go to here and see guys radius 100 percent thickness increase like 50 right and guys size i take increase like 300 and 300 yes right okay so guys now i create animation so i increase frame like 220 yes and guys size go to zero and press this animation key yes guys now i go to like 130 frame here 130 go to 130 frame and 
scale size increased like 1000 yes guys little bit more i take like go to back like 1200 yes 1200 is better and press this animation key yeah so go to back and play yes see guys that's really good go to back and play yeah that's really smooth right okay so guys now i apply delay factor tool so select this cloner and use delay yeah and i go to effector mode i take spring and strength i take like 70 yes and play yes see guys that's really good it's for beginners yeah better right okay so guys all is good now i create one more effect so select this plane and copy press ctrl c and v and guys select this cloner and i go to effector and see guys that's my effector so select this plane one drag and drop in effector yeah and guys select this plane one and change only guys graph editor keyframe so i go to timeline f curve and create smaller yes guys select and guys holding control key so i go to like 90 frame 90 and shift on 90 frame like this yeah that's it so close go to back and play yes that's really good yeah right it's really good guys that's really simple animation okay all is good now guys i already create materials i apply material so i go to create and load material guys i already create material so that's my material file and open see so apply on gold material on cloner yes that's beautiful and i go to take sky and guys see that's my sky material up now on sky and guys that's not correct it's looking like black so re-upload luminous texture go to sdri and re-upload this texture this one yes right okay so guys lastly right click on sky and take compositing tag and scene by camera unchecked yes okay so guys also apply background so select this background and apply like pink color on background yes and guys my camera angle like this and render preview yeah that's really beautiful and guys now i go to on render setting and effect guys i use only global illumination guys don't use MD occlusion this animation you only use global emission and indirectly catch a i take low and anti select best that's it so go to save and guys you can take jpeg otherwise you can take mp4 format direct for movie i use jpeg sequences and go to desktop create new folder like this and take any file name yeah and guys go to output and you can take full frame that's my full hd frame otherwise you can take this one this one hd and use all frame right okay so guys close and camera angle like this yes right and play yes see guys right and render preview okay so guys i take direct render and full frame so guys filter enable filter check saturation i take 20 and contrast i take 10 yes after render save this image and see guys that's my final render it's looking so beautiful gold material 
right okay so guys that's it it's my final render finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you